We are glad to introduce you to the PDF blueprint. I will present it in four parts. Measurement function, comment function, intelligent function, convert and organize. First is the measurement function. You can use the categories function to set the categories of the comments. For example, ground floor, first floor, second floor, etc. Before measuring, select the appropriate category to facilitate future summarization. For accurate measurements, you need to set the scale. Specify two points and enter the true length of the two points. Then, click the measure button. You can measure the linear length, that is, the horizontal or vertical distance between two points, a lined length, which is a straight line distance between two points, and the continuous length. You can specify the points one by one and output the total length at the end. Next, area and perimeter measurements. The first is the rectangular area through two points. The second is the plug-in area. You click on the points of the plug-in one by one. And finally, generate the area. For polygons and shapes containing curves, we recommend using the autofill function, which means you don't have to specify points. Then there's the count function. Select count markup colors and shapes you like. Click on the positions you want to count one by one. Don't forget to switch categories to ensure that all measurements are in the correct category. All the measurements you made are displayed in the tabulate function. In tabulate window, you can view and filter categories, and you can export your measurements to Excel. In the exported Excel, you can also see the categories, which is convenient for summarizing. The second part is the comment function. You can use the line, pen, and highlight functions to make comments. Highlight functions include highlight pen, highlight rectangle, and highlight polygon. And you can add text anywhere to note drawing information. Under the markup function, there are many shaped markers. Here are clouds, arrows, leaders, rectangles, and ellipses. Sequence is another important comment function. You can set the prefix, suffix, border shape, and lead line style. Click on the numbered positions one by one. It is also a good counting function. After making the sequence, you can export the sequence to Excel. Part three is the intelligent function. The first is extract text under OCR. Box the text to recognize it and copy it with one click. The second is extract table. Box the table and export to Excel. The text and topography are perfectly reproduced. The third is create searchable PDF. Except under OCR, this function is available under convert and in find. It converts non-searchable PDF to searchable PDF. And all the results of the search will be flagged on the PDF easy to view. The fourth is the compare drawings function. Set base points to align drawings. Same and different parts are color coded for easy identification. The last part is convert and organize. The first conversion function is PDF to CAD. You can use CAD Reader to open CAD files. The second conversion function is PDF to image. The third conversion function is image to PDF. When it comes to the organize function, combine documents is to merge multiple PDFs into one PDF. Split document is splitting a multi-page PDF into multiple PDFs. Extract pages is to extract some pages from a multi-page PDF. Delete pages is to remove some pages of a multi-page PDF.